There was a song on Hex Induction Air, Hit Priest, that they redid on a Curious Orange soundtrack, which has got this line, he is not appreciated. And every encore for Time Immemorial now has involved him handing the mic out to a member of the audience who can then shout, he is not appreciated. And I think that there's a kind of feedback loop there of the audience flattering Mark e. Smith, saying, we know how good you are, but you're playing to these kind of crowds at this level. But there's also um, a bit of flattery going the other way. It's one of uh, those rare moments where he is approving of the audience and saying, but you know, you know I'm really good. It's part of him that is so fucking furious with his obscurity and his poverty, considering how, how brilliant he is, and then part of him that really, really just wouldn't want it any other way. I think there's a lot of deception going on sometimes with Mark. He wants an audience, he wants to be appreciated, he deserves to be appreciated, or feels he does. And some of it's just showbiz. I'm an anti-star, but I shine brightly. He lives in his own weird little world, and it's not a world I particularly want to be part of, but, you know, it's Mark Smith, what he does is brilliant, and you can never write him off. It is to Manchester's glory that, yes, we have Ian Curtis and Sean Ryder and Ian Brown and, um, let's forget the Gallagher brothers, but without Mark E, that heritage would be a much, much poorer place. And the fact that I'm calling him heritage, he'll fucking hate, so I'm glad I said it. I respect Mark for continuing to beat his own path through the, the jungle that is life. You know, even if there's a well-worn path three or four feet to the left or right of him, he's still going to go down the middle, and uh, that's got to be good. I've got, I've got plenty to say, you know. I'm going to carry on saying that.